Okay, late before. I know it's not dark out, but we'll see how this goes. Now we're going to put in these uh, the H4s for the headlights and uh, these H11s for the fog lights. Apparently there's, uh, they're a little different. They're, Toyota made their own light bulb for them and it's not really a true H11 for the fog lights. So it should be fun. we got to get to it from back in here. But I think I'm, I should be able to reach it through there. But what a pain. you got to get the grill off. There's a bunch of little clips holding the headlights on. And should be good now that they're out. And you got to take all this off if you ever want to change the marker bulb. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Now again, this is just a regular halogen light bulbs shining on the floor. So I'm ready to throw them in. And uh, we'll see what they look like after I throw them in. We'll do a one by one comparison. Yeah, there's the difference. That's huge, bright. Uh, we'll see how it looks in the night. They're saying sometimes that these lights don't throw light as far. I don't quite understand that, but you know, I think bright is bright. Uh, the fan hums. I'm up in Canada, so a lot of guys are saying they don't need to put the little dust booty on, but there's a lot of moisture from the hot and cold. I'm going to cut it to fit around that fan. Now hopefully it doesn't impede in any which way, but uh, yeah, I'll see what it, uh, what it does. Now the other thing I'm doing while I'm in here too is I'm just changing out all these bulbs to LEDs. I mean, you're in here. I've already had these ones burn out on me. And uh, so all you need is a nice LED bulb and a, I can't remember what the ohm is resistor. I have to clip it into the wiring here somewhere. And uh, then I can save my head, myself the headache of having burned out bulbs in the future, because this... Okay. Well, I couldn't use the uh, bulbs I bought for the LEDs, uh, for, the, uh, for the marker bulbs. They were just blowing the fuse left and right, so... But there's my standard fog bulb. And there's my new fog bulb. Pretty big difference. Anyways, we'll get back to it shortly. I should say there's a pretty big difference. Um, uh, oof, so I can't even gauge as to how much. Probably at least 50% brighter. Those are the brights. So hopefully these don't have too much uh, blinding effect on oncoming drivers. But I think I'll be driving without the fog lights on. Okay, Oxbeam H4 headlights and H16 fog lights. Uh, it's a little darker out, so I'll start them up. See what they look like. Those are uh, <laughs> bright dim. Yeah, proximity sensor. darn bright if you ask me look like they put out pretty good light everyone was kind of saying that they don't throw a very long or deep beam but I don't quite understand how that'll work motorized control still works Pretty sweet. Thanks, Oxbeam. They look pretty good. We'll take a walk on the outside. Yeah, I don't think I'll be driving with uh, fog lights on too much. Anyways, 